welcome back to my channel beauties how are you guys doing your girl kelly is here one more time to share her twist on caca pigeon achomo with you okay so here i have my flour and i added some salt and then some sugar and then some baking powder and nutmeg you see all the measurement in my description uh box okay so make sure you check my description box so after mixing all the dry ingredients together i dig a little bit of hole and i add my butter that's one stick of butter that means half cup of butter and one egg and then i'm adding my onion and garlic blended that was uh garlic and onion blended together so for this recipe um most of the time we you don't need um egg we don't need egg and what we need what we usually need traditional is water but for me i added some egg to just give it the, a little bit of nutrition because it's just flour and uh, sugar and stuff so here i am uh I flowered, I flowered my ball to make it easy for myself to mold my dough and uh, after finishing molding my dough I'll go ahead and uh, cut it in some small pieces three or four uh, small pieces and then I'll go ahead and flatten my dough and then cut it up so I will, I'll just leave it watch it to the end don't leave guys okay so if you like what you are seeing here on this channel guys don't forget you're not gonna pay is free out of charge just go ahead and push the red button subscribe okay subscribe and activate all your uh, bell notifications so you get notified every time i upload new videos okay so thank you for watching and all your comments are much much very much appreciated so here after uh flatten my dough i'll go ahead and cut it so for this recipe you for this chin chin or a chomo or caca pigeon you can cut it in a can any how you want so you can cut it in a small ball or small square and like a string like this what i'm doing here kind of screen string sorry so is up to you guys so this is my uh togo achomo or caca pigeon my twist because i say my twist because i added some egg you don't need usually we don't use egg for it instead of egg people use water and the main um recipe for the achoma i will post it another day for this little one that we cut in like kind of square we will have make and other stuff so this is the simplest one just watch me cut my uh dough in some small string and then voila nothing much and i'll go ahead and uh, deep fry it after the cutting process okay guys back to you let's uh So now I have my pan on fire 
and I am adding some oil and then you uh you let your oil get hot hot should I say hot or warm you don't want it too hot okay hot but not too hot then here I am trying my testing my oil to see if it's ready to go so as you can see it was ready then i am adding my um achomondo so when you add them usually it, it, it will flow you like you saw the the single one you come up on the top so it's kind of foamy right now don't please don't go away just keep on stirring it stir 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 you don't want it to get burned that's why you will not let it go you just keep on stirring now it's ready you see that beautiful color with the foam you think that it will suck up the oil but no it will it was so perfect no extra oil it was just pleasing to eat and tasty thank you so much for watching guys i will see you guys next time don't forget please don't forget to like share and subscribe subscribe abonne toi okay Au revoir, à plus. Bye.